I'm gonna actually put the bag in the tank and see what he does. Oh, he's coming out. This dude is coming out. Oh, bass got him. How about that? Yo, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. And you guys today, we're gonna try to get some really, really nice feedings of the bass and maybe even the catfish, maybe even the rock bass eating some goldfish. Hey guys, I just went up and picked four dozen feeders up at the store right now, at the pet store. And um, yeah, I'm not gonna feed all of them. I'm gonna feed like eight or ten of them. Then I'll put the rest in that tank right there. So I'm gonna go and acclimate onto this tank, and I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Finish acclimating the goldfish. I'm gonna actually put the bag in the tank and see what he does. He's back there in the back. Oh, he's coming out. This dude is coming out. See, so guys, actually, when I was feeding the rock bass some worms and the catfish some worms uh, yesterday. Uh, the bass actually ate one. I was very surprised. So that means he's pretty well settled in. So uh, let's see if we can get him to eat some goldfish. That'd be really nice. All right, you guys, first goldfish right there. I'm about to drop him in. Oh my gosh. I did not expect that. The rock bass just came out and just slammed it before the bass could even, like, look at it. All right, let's try this again. Second goldfish going in. There he goes. And the rock bass just slammed that again. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Third goldfish going in. Oh. Oh. Bass got him. How about that? That bass just slammed him. The last bass that I had this size, you guys all remember on Bister Bass, if you've been subscribed to the channel for a while now. I used to feed that bass like seven goldfish at a time every single day. So this one is about the same size as that one. So... Hopefully we can, uh, we'll get him start eating that much as well. Hey guys, I'm not always going to feed him goldfish. I like switch it up. I feed him like crickets, lizards, and, um, worms and all that kind of stuff. I'll switch it up sometimes, but they really, really like goldfish. Oh yeah, remember that, uh, salamander thing that I told you guys about? Well, I looked it up and it was actually not a salamander. It was actually a skink. I kind of figured it wasn't a salamander because they weren't like a moist skin like most salamanders are or all salamanders are. It was actually a broad-headed skink. Apparently they eat, like, other skinks and everything and all kinds of other stuff. Anyways, guys, check out this clip from earlier today. All right, you guys, so remember that salamander that I was telling you guys about was in this turtle tank? He's been in here for now over, like, two days now. So I dropped one of my worms in there that I feed my fish over there in the big tank. And basically, you guys, he is going ham on the worm right now. Look at him. He's got that worm in his mouth. It started kind of creeping closer to him on the rock, and then all of a sudden he just struck at it and got it. He's got it about halfway in his mouth now and just clamped down on it. So, guys, that was a pretty cr crazy clip, I think, um, for just him climbing in there like two, two days ago and then me just dropping a worm in there and then him eating it out. It was pretty, it was pretty crazy, I got to say. All right, you guys, I think Mr. Bass is ready for some more goldfish. We're going to try to feed him a few more. Here we go. He knows. He saw my hand go up. There he is. Oh, oh. Let's see if he will blow up on it. Will he actually eat out of my hand? I, I don't think he will yet. Oh, 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 got it, he is really lighting him up now, he is definitely not really fattened up, and that's what I'm trying to get him as, like, I'm trying to get him, like, really, really fattened up, so, try to feed him a few more goldfish, try to do that, got him, oh my gosh, I got this one right here that I just, like, chopped the head off of, I'm gonna drop it down to the bottom and see if the boy had catfish will actually eat it. See, guys, the other half of the body did not actually sink down. So it's actually floating up there, and the Mr. Bass was actually kind of looking at it. But uh, the head is actually down here by the driftwood, and you can see the bullhead starting to move. Now he smells it. He smells something down here. Here we go, another another goldfish right here. I really, really would like to get him eating out of my hand. He will eventually, but right now I doubt he will. Got him. That's another one. Oh, oh, he got it. Boy, he got the goldfish head. She has Mr. Bass. Oh, oh, he's about to eat the body. And he just got the body that was floating up there. He is really, really fattening up now. Drop this last one in the tank. See if he'll eat it. There he goes. Oh, he, uh, he's kind of full now. That's, he's eating technically six because that other one, but I'll call it five and a half. Oh, is he actually going to eat it? Oh. He wants to eat it, but he knows he's just a little bit too full. Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. Oh, oh. Be just right here for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed that feeding of Mr. Bass chomping down on some goldfish. Only been in the tank for two days, and he's already ate 
freaking five and a half goldfish. He probably just ate the other one now that I walked away. And you guys, I know the lighting was kind of bad just because it's kind of later in the day and it was up under the awning and it's kind of overcast out here anyway. So I know the lighting was kind of bad, but I'll get some better feedings later on in the week and all that. And we'll maybe like do some like lizard feedings where I'll drop a lizard in the tank every once in a while when I find it outside. See him blow up on that, see him blow up on some crickets. I'll get him to start eating out of my hand and all that. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure you guys drop a like on the video. Make sure you guys subscribe if you have not. And let me say, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. I don't want to die for them to miss me. Yes, I see the things that they wishing on me. Hope I got some brothers that outlive me.